Hello to all dear friends and welcome to the Blue Cube YouTube channel. In this video, you will learn how to pick up and drop objects in Moho Pro software. I have already imported the character. Make sure the slider is at frame 0. First, I select the bone layer and select the image from the layers section. I select the desired image and click the open button. I resize the sword image. The sword layer should be below the upper hand layer. So I drag it and place it below the hand layer. I use the transform tool to resize and adjust the sword image. I select the bone layer and change the hand position with smart bone. To be more precise, I double-click on the hand action in the action section and modify the hand. After finishing, I double-click on Mainline. Now I place the sword in the desired location so that the character can pick it up. I select the bone layer again and create a bone for the sword using the add bone tool. I select the sword layer and bind the bone to the layer. I set the bone strength to zero and also make sure it is not connected to any other bones. Now I move the slider to frame 12 and adjust the character to pick up the sword. I move the slider to frame 7 and click on the smart bone to create additional keyframes. In frame 12, I change the hand position. Make sure the auto freeze keys option is enabled to create keyframes for all bones. I select the sword bone and connect it to the hand bone using the reparent bone tool. This way, the hand and sword are now connected. I copy the keyframes from frame 23 to frame 36 to keep the hand still. In frame 48, I move the hand. To have the character drop the sword, disconnect the hand and sword again using the reparent bone tool. 
First, open the hand and then disconnect the sword from the hand to have the character drop the sword. Here are some additional tips. Make sure the sword image is in the correct position and size before binding it to the bone. Use the auto freeze keys option to create keyframes for all bones when animating the character. Use the reparent bone tool to connect and disconnect the hand and sword bones. Thank you for staying with me until the end of this video. Remember, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, Click the subscribe button or the subscribe below the video, and please like the video. Goodbye for now.